Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we are doing Top 5 Reasons Why Minecraft Concert Edition. I am excited. I have not been this excited since I did my last one which was like 3 days ago. But anyway, uh, I hope you guys enjoy the video. And if you do make sure to drop a like at any point. And if you're new to the channel make sure to subscribe. I'm doing this all at the beginning so I don't have to do it at the end. It's really awkward when it's at the end. I don't know why but it just is for me. But anyway. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll talk to you all later. Here's my top 5 reasons why Minecraft Console Edition. Now guys, the first night of Minecraft is always going to be the hardest night of Minecraft. We've all got lots of mobs around, roaming around, and you've got these things. I do not class them as rob as as mobs. I class them as a curse to the world. The evil creepers. Now what they do is they blow you up. So you stay away from them. Then you have the zombies, which are just just zombies. They just chase you and try to eat you. And then you have your skeletons. Now they shoot bow and arrows at you. So they are distance. Very dangerous. I know. And then you have your spiders. They just chase you. Try and eat your soul. And then you have Enderman. That that thing over there. That's holding a block. You stare at that right in the eyes. That thing will hunt you down. And it will not stop until you are dead. Or you quit the game. Whichever. But the way you can get past this is make a bed Just it's just simple make a bed skip today that, that's all you have to do doesn't seem that hard right? wrong you're new to the game you first start off you have no idea how to make a bed you don't even know if beds are a thing in minecraft because you're brand new to the game you don't watch videos on it or anything like that you just thought I'm gonna check out this game because my friends recommend it or something like that and you get to your first night now you do what you're supposed to do, you make a little base, make sure you've got enough resources to get you through the night, but you do not make a bed. Which means, you have to stand here, for an entire night, waiting, to get murdered. Enchanting! Let's do some enchanting. Oh, I'm excited. Next, enchant my first weapon. What shall we do? Level 30. Do I have 30 levels? I have 31. Amazing. What a coincidence. Let's put some lapis in there and we'll get knocked back to. Knocked back to. Insane. Amazing. Now what this does guys is this makes your weapons or your gear tougher than they already are. So for example <laughs> Knockback 2 gives me the ability to knock down it knock back any mob very far. Which helps you in a fight when you're going up against something like a creeper or a zombie. Or even a skeleton. But not really. Ooh chicken. Food. Food is a necessity in survival Minecraft. If you do not have food, you will starve to death very quickly. So your best bet is to kill off any cows you see or any pigs. Those are the ones that give you a lot and lot of food. It fills back up your hunger bars. It also gives you levels. So you can still get, get to doing some enchanting from killing animals. You can also create your own pens, you can breed your animals, create more, kill them off. I sound like a psychopath, I apologise, but... Minecraft biomes. 
Now what this is, is an area of land in Minecraft that is completely different to another. For example, here we've got grassy lands, or what I like to call flatlands. Over here you've got mountain lands, you've got sand, there is a desert in places, and over here you've got mushroom island, and you've got snow biome. You also have a jungle biome, and it's just awesome. Here's a better example of the mountain biome. Look at this place. It's mushrooms! Mushrooms! <laughs> your imagination last but not least your imagination is the key to everything minecraft without your imagination there would simply be no minecraft your, imagine can t your imagination can take you places you never knew existed you could build castles build skyscrapers then blow them up for no particular reason. Without your imagination, Minecraft would just be boring. So I say a big thumbs up to your imagination for giving you so many amazing ideas for building, constructing, and that is off. Damn it, symmetrical. Symmetrical. For giving you ideas for amazing buildings. And I mean, if you just look on YouTube, you can see things amazing people have managed to be able to create with their imagination and their imagination only. I mean, if it wasn't for them, I wouldn't have ideas for my build that I would. I mean, the first idea I had for a build was a Batman symbol. And then pixel art of Hulk. But then I started to look bigger and bigger and decided to create skyscrapers and towns and villages. Your imagination is the foundation of Minecraft. Without your imagination, this game would not exist. It's the pinnacle point of Minecraft. And I'm just going to finish this off because why not, you know, just let, let my imagination run wild for a minute. This is a very, this is not what you think it is. I'm kidding, it is, it's, it's a penis, I, I drew a penis. Your imagination can take you many places. Especially to a drawing of a penis. When you've run out of ideas. Thank you for watching.